All right, I'm back at Infocom for day two, and I brought somebody with me. My buddy, Pat Burke. Now I have to like adjust the camera for you because you're taller than me. Perfect. We're here in beautiful Orlando at Infocom. And I've never been to one, so I'm excited to see what's here and network a little bit. Yeah, so we're gonna see what kind of trouble we get into today. Yesterday I fell short, walked around, started sweating really bad, got dizzy a little bit, and said I, I need to go home and rest. So hopefully I have the endurance today to make it through Infocom and see some of the other stuff I haven't seen yet. So let's get into it. So typically, Pat, with these things, since this is your first one, just always fake it till you make it. If someone asks you a question, say, oh yeah, I know that, I know that. No, I know, I'm just kidding. Because I know you're totally against that. Fake it, fake it. I know, just go magic, just go magic, go magic. Hi, I'm Pat Burke, former NBA player. I'm here with my friend Jeff Adams. We're gonna go around and we're going to actually price out, creating a whole studio security system. We're gonna, no limit budget. Security system? Everything, all around the house. Um, and we're gonna see how much stuff that we can rack up. So at the end of the show, you're gonna see how much money potentially we can spend. Well, that's the problem, Pat. Most of these people don't have their prices on the table. So if they had the prices on the table, a lot of people wouldn't be here right now. Uh, well, viewers don't know that. So, but they, they, they know they, now. They, they know now. <laughs> So typically these conferences, you know, Infocom, more like for AV, audio and video, houses of worship, theater, cruise ships, entertainment, any kind of equipment you would install, security systems, TVs. Pat's going to work for one of the distributors already. <laughs> I'm making, I'm making sales. Hopefully I run into some my buddies around here slumming it up at Boost. Have paid actors that can just. The crazy thing is, these paid actors, you would think they would be able to be on their phone, but they've got to act like they're actually reading books, like they do that in real life. But they should just let them be on their phones because that's what they'd be doing anyways, you know what I mean? You're, you're, these are paid actors to do this? Yeah. Looks like the shot you'd see for in, a, in a soap opera. You know, like the quality of how it was picked up. I think that girl is multitasking. I'm fascinated about these girls, and here's why. You see the blonde? Yeah. Right there? I think she has her book, and she looks like she's reading, but I believe that her phone's laying on top of the book, and she's multitasking. And then she moves into the side like she's not on her phone. I think her phone's inside the book. Busted. You know, years ago, Pat, I was working for a company out of Paris and I reached out to you on Facebook and said, you need to set one of these up. And you were talking with me back and forth, but you kept, you know, brushing me aside. I was gonna sell you like a four camera setup <laughs> for your uh, sports complex, but you would have been set up like this. Oh, this monitor is, all the yeah, kids. Yeah, I've always wanted to, to bring the, uh, the fade in, fade out on that like that. So. Touch it, go ahead and do it. Yeah, I think I'm ready for the alarm to go off. Boom. You see that right there? Look, it's me. Right here, right, ready? And you're watching the Rangers playing that orange team, and we're going right back now to sales at Infocom. Yeah, but this place is, uh, 
it's not as busy as yesterday. Like you can even walk down these uh, these little halls or whatever you call these little carpet halls. What what is this? The carpet? It was like sh shoulder to shoulder. But it's Friday. These people have been here since Monday, so these people are doing the, sh the trade shows. Are ready to go home at four o'clock. They're itching to get back home to wherever home is for them. A lot of different uh, people from all over the world here. Hearing a lot of different languages. Yeah, it, people travel worldwide for this thing. You know, I haven't seen any. I haven't seen any really tall people. I think you're probably uh, the tallest so far. Well. I think I'm good. You, you seen enough? I think so. It's been a it's been an experience. After a while, it all looks the same <laughs> to me. A lot of television. Yeah. So I think we're gonna get up out of here and head back home. Out.